welcome back to 100 baby we are here with april and she's just kind of hanging out in the back garden doing some painting now it is finally the weekend so i feel like now we're really going to be able to play catch up with a lot of this stuff that we weren't able to get done all week so i'm going to have her come over and we're actually going to harvest all of our garden and i don't think the boys had i don't know no i think we did all of their homework oh he did find another toy 165 okay so everybody did get all of their work done now Blake I kind of want him to go on a little adventure now in case you guys maybe are not too caught up Blake seems to be struggling a little bit with schooling I feel like he just really wants to be outside and that's kind of where his mind is at all times so we're trying to get him a little more focused with school just to bring his grades up because I think he's like barely a C student. So he definitely has a lot of stuff that he's gonna have to work on. I don't think that he can do any of the gardening. I might have April go over to the community garden after. Now I'm just kind of getting April right now just to get working on money making stuff. So we're doing a little bit of painting. I'm still trying really hard to get her to have a masterpiece be created. We have not had that happen yet. So we're also going to finish um, doing some of the writing as well. Now Aaron, <laughs> he seems to really love basketball and just kind of like shooting around. And I do have the toddlers kind of preoccupied so that we can also get working on their skills. So Dream has to get working on communication, imagination, actually kind of everything. She's kind of at the bottom of the list for everything just because she is like the newest child. So let's actually go in here, do a bunch of babbling, fill this all up. Oh my God, you guys, she did a masterpiece. Like literally, I just said that. <laughs> then we needed to have a masterpiece. So we made 1,265 simoleons. So let's come in here and sell this. Oh my God, it's it's a little farmer. I wish we had that kind of stuff actually in The Sims. I feel like they're just kind of teasing us. Ooh, wait, what's this? Oh my God. You are about to sell a masterpiece. These are very rare. Are you sure you wanna do this? No, but we have to because we are broke. Okay, wait. Aaron is going through a phase. He is feeling rebellious and will seek to challenge parental authority. <gasps> Why would you do such a thing? <laughs> Let's do another large classic. Oh my God, we finally have a lot of money. I wonder if this would be like a good time to actually put a bathroom in. Hmm. Maybe, this is kind of what I was thinking to like put it here and put two doors in. Actually, let's just test it out. I'm gonna see if it'll work. That bathroom is like the normal size. And if we do need to put in like another bed eventually, we can still do that. So let's just put that there we'll move the kitty cats over here and put that there okay where am i gonna put all of there's so much stuff here so let's put little uh gary over there and we can move oh my god that's what's broken i was wondering i kept hearing this like weird noise all right so let's put some doors in we can put one there maybe. So it's gonna be like a really simple bathroom, but I want it to be kind of like children oriented. So it's probably gonna have like a lot of bright colors in it as well. So let's put this here and okay. So that works. Now they're gonna need to have a door that works as well. Okay, so there is two doors to get into that bathroom that's gonna work perfectly for like the children and teens and I might just keep the walls similar just so that it kind of blends because I mean the children's room it is also blue so it just kind of like matches it doesn't have any windows but I feel like we don't even really have the space for that how much is this 1500 that's a lot of money we only have 500 simoleons but I'm gonna skip this sink for now and we're just gonna put in like a really cheap little toilet and we can like add to it after. I just feel like this is definitely a necessity to have a second bathroom. 
and there that should be a lot better everybody is kind of like waiting for the other one all the time so this will kind of hold us over <laughs> hopefully you guys like it i mean this bedroom was really weird shaped it's like a t so it kind of like fits in and once we get making a little bit more money we can definitely add in like nicer things and maybe even like put in a window <laughs> i think that would look better okay so april is painting away hopefully another masterpiece because we kind of now we're in a little bit of a pickle because I mean if we get any mail that's like bills I don't even know what we're gonna do okay what are you gonna do Bobby whiz kid um I'm trying to think what he could do to actually like help browse art to like help him with schooling oh, we could practice typing oh my god look at dream and Bobby oh my god I think like she's like in love with him <laughs> She's like the best brother in the world, Bobby. She just like wants to be in here with him. And he's like really enjoying her company. <gasps> Do you guys remember not that long ago, Bobby was so upset that he was getting a new sister. Like he was throwing a temper tantrum. And, ooh, wait, let's keep on doing all of this for Dream. But he was really not feeling having a new sibling. And it was unwanted sibling, I believe. So I feel like these two are really starting to bond, which I knew would happen once Dream did age up. So we're just gonna keep on having her do that. It must have brought stuff up a bit. She does seem to be a little bit of a wanderer. <laughs> her movement skill is up pretty far. Okay, we reached. Aaron's doing good. What the heck was that? <laughs> oh. It's probably Salem we're gonna have to cancel we have a lot to do even though they probably should just because it is the weekend but we kind of have a lot to do I do want the boys just to be a little bit more active in the home we're gonna get him to browse art and we're gonna practice typing with him as well and hopefully that's gonna improve his grades who is here <gasps> is that Akira oh my god Akira you yeah you come on in oh my god did he come to see dream <laughs> he's like cool. let me in yes you are definitely welcome here akira oh dream okay you're gonna have to go over and talk to your dad we can make funny faces <gasps> this is actually the perfect opportunity to have akira potty train her so I think we're gonna get him to do it a couple times just to bring that up. Oh my god, that toilet is a mess. Okay, April, let's clean that. <laughs> That's a little bit embarrassing. So we are gonna have Akira really just pull his sleeves up and help us out around the house. And who else do we have? There's a little dream going to Akira. She's like, hey daddy. <laughs> Communication and level three. Oh my goodness. Man, I just can't get over how much she looks just like her father. <laughs> All right, Akira, you help Dream. Is he going to take her in? Potty help, let's try this again. No, we're not going to talk. You need to help us. This is what we needed you to come over for. Oh, he's telling her a dinosaur story. <laughs> and April. Poor April, you guys. I feel really bad that she can't, like, have a boyfriend or even, like, get married. I feel like she would make the perfect wife. She's, like, so family-oriented. Okay, you... Can you pick me up? Yes. Come over. Train me. Oh, who's calling us? Hey April, it's me, Marcus. No thanks, we already got what we wanted from Marcus. <laughs> All right, so Dream is now being potty trained and I think we could actually start training one of the others. So who has the lowest potty right now? Okay, so you are two and one. All right, so we're gonna train Carter. Let's go in. Carter, we need to work on you. We should probably even like change his outfit. I feel like he's been wearing the same outfit 
forever. Um, where's your outfit, buddy? Um, change outfit. Please say, there we go. Let's wear that. That is so much better. <laughs> it is 145. He does not need to still be in his pajamas. Okay, so where is everybody else? Blake, he is still on the computer. Oh my god, we found a fossil. I'm gonna like just check out everybody else's inventory. Oh, let's let's put this back down. Erin, <laughs> how the heck do you have all of these in there? April, okay, let's sell our blackberries. 341. And strawberries. Okay, so we made a little bit of money, but definitely nothing that's really gonna pay any bills. So let's sell our painting. 478 simoleons, so that's actually not that bad. And Aaron, I'm probably gonna get him to come in and practice some typing as well once the others are done. Carter has reached level two. Okay, let's, I think we should probably do that again. Let's get a cure to help dream. And wait, who's calling? Don is wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. Okay. <laughs> Let's go over and see Don. We have not seen him in forever. And actually, we might even be able to see other people that are over in the city. I'm trying to remember where it is that Don lives. Oh, Oasis. <gasps> Oh my. <laughs> Can you imagine if Aaron actually like inherited inherit inherits his father's house? Discuss interests. Okay, where is our bedroom? Ooh. Is this our stepmother, Dina? Are you gonna like us? Let's just do a friendly introduction. Just because I do feel like Aaron does like everybody. <laughs> where are we going? Wait, uh, Dawn, you have two? Which one's my stepmother? Oh my God, is Dawn showing us our bedroom? Oh, I'd kind of like the green one a little bit better, but this is actually really nice. Okay, so let's claim our bed. That is really, really sweet of Dawn to have this like little area all set up for us. Even if not intentional, <laughs> this is going to be our room. Okay. Dina, is it? Um, I don't think she expected him to be over here. Aaron, you, you need to change this outfit. You, your mother dresses you a lot better than this. Ooh, let's put on this cute little outfit. You're visiting people. You have to look presentable. Oh, we need to have a shower. Let's go over in here. We can take a bath before we head home. So Dawn's house is actually really nice, you guys. I think this is the first time, like seriously, that I have ever actually seen inside this home. And I could totally picture Aaron living in this when he decides to like move out. Once he gets older and like start his own family, I think this would be like the perfect spot for that. So he's just having a bubble bath washing his curls and then we're gonna end up heading back home oh my god he's done <laughs> let's get dressed we're gonna head back home so that was really sweet of dawn to do that just to invite us over and kind of give us a little bit of a tour of the home oh what there's even a giraffe <laughs> over here in the freaking dining room all right so aaron he's kind of had a really good day now i mean Aaron is doing really well for himself. He's even like really made sure to work on his grades in school. He seems to be able to make a lot of time to like do extra credit activity. So he definitely is a whiz kid. And I don't know, I think that's just kind of lifted his spirits to really push himself a little bit more because he wants to be able to afford his father's house one day once he gets it because it's definitely gonna be really expensive to afford like upkeep on that house. Okay, are we gonna seriously run all the way home? There we go. 
All right, so that was actually really interesting. Let me know what you guys think because I know I had talked about before when the children start aging up that I was actually gonna start moving them like into the homes that are around the town. But I mean, we're gonna have a hundred people to move in all around all of the world. <laughs> oh my God, Dream, what are you doing outside? You need to go in here, Dream. You need to get potty trained again. When I grow up, I want to be a ninja. Wait. Okay, Bobby has this thing about, let's just, let's just get a ninja outfit. And we're going to get Akira to help Dream. While he is still here, how is everybody making it? Look at Bobby doing his chores. Oh my god, go potty. And go potty. Okay, so they are really good. Oh my god, look at him run on his tippy toes. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, so what do we have everybody up to? Oh my god, you're level four movement, so you're just like boogieing around. So we're gonna have to work on potty a little bit more and thinking as well as imagination. Recess, we're not even at school, it's a Saturday. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, so last recess, no one wanted to play with me. I just climbed around on my own. If that happens again, what should I do? Ask other kids if you can join in, talk to the teacher, play on your own. Might as well just ask people. They probably don't even know that you want to play with them. Okay, so we have a little double trouble here working together. And wait. Are you going to go to the other toilet? Okay, why don't we just use the romance festival? Wait, dream. Oh, we don't have any other potties. And who is calling us? Marcus? No. I hear the festival. We have to cancel. We need a teenager so bad so we can leave the house. All right, who are we going to train next? <gasps> who is this stranger? Oh. Aaron's responsibility in range to earn responsible trait. Ooh, okay. We'll get him to do a little bit more. All right, let's do a friendly introduction. We definitely need to expand everybody that we know in our social circle. So, Aaron, what can you do? Is there anything that we can clean? Uh, maybe we can take out the garbage, empty trash, no. And we're probably also gonna need to get um, a clothesline or washing machine. I think maybe we could put like a washing machine right here. We don't really have enough right yet, but read no. Cody, level three. Oh my God, everybody is doing so good today. I feel like some days everybody does miserable and then other days like today, it just seems to be going like really well. Okay, so Blake, you can come dig. Maybe there's some more around now. Actually, you could probably even go fishing. I'm going to get him to try to catch some fish because we can sell those. So, Blake. Saturdays are like the perfect time for Blake to be outside <laughs> because we don't have any work for him to do. Okay, why does everybody that come over to our house, they like just go right to the computer? Okay, you are playing. Um, maybe you should come in here and practice typing. Everybody's probably getting really hungry. I should probably set some food out. We have some chili. Let's put this here and some chowder. Okay, yes, Dream is definitely really hungry. And you can have some. Hopefully there's enough. I'm probably gonna just have to get April to start making some more meals. What did we miss? Blake found a piece of limestone. Oh yes, this. Replace for 300, oh my God. Laugh at broken sign. <laughs> sure, we can do that. All right, so April, you're gonna have to come over here. We're gonna have to start making up some meals. So we are definitely gonna run out. Let's do some more, ooh, let's do camper stew. 
cook a gourmet meal. Gourmet fruit cake. Let's just make a really nice cake. Or no, let's do garlic noodles. <laughs> oh my god, that is so freaking cute how they are just like running on their tippy toes. Okay, so everybody is eating, getting their bellies full. Bobby's gonna have to come over. Blake caught. Ooh, worth five dollars. Blake. He's like making us some money. Lots of money. Okay, listen, don't you dare come over here and eat our food. We are running low. All right, let's kind of take a peek what's going on. Okay, so we don't have another masterpiece, but let's sell this. And then April's probably going to start writing. Can we just repair? I kind of got to start saving a little bit of money. <laughs> the bathroom renovation kind of took quite a bit of money away. And actually, we need to put in the flooring. Okay. There. That's better. <laughs> I was going to say, what the heck is different? Okay, so everybody's just catching up on everything. Now, I definitely have my fingers crossed that over the weekend with Aaron, like practicing typing and doing a bunch of stuff on the computer, and he's done his homework and extra credit. So, I mean, if we, he doesn't become an A student soon, I'll cry. Looks like the fish in this area are too crafty. Try using more valuable bait. Oh my God, wait, we did get a frog. Blake, he is like, he can find everything. I don't even know if we have enough space to like put another frog. Oh my God, Blake. <laughs> he just has like so much stuff. Actually, we could probably just set this at the bottom of the bed. And this is only $10. So I think it's better if we just end up keeping it. Aaron's just doing the dishes and I think he's just gonna be like such a good little helper around the house. Manners. Okay, wait, let's set the table with casual party fancy. We'll just do casual. Blue, yellow, let's do yellow. It'll definitely match the sunflowers. Oh my God, manners. <laughs> okay, so that like fits perfectly with the table. Aaron, you are doing awesome. And dream, is Akira still here? We could probably get some potty help. Oh wait, Akira did leave. What time is it? It is 9.30, okay. Everybody needs to go to bed. The boys have already gone to sleep. Blake and Bobby do need to go to bed. And then we have Aaron. You need to go to sleep as well. So let's just get off the computer. That is enough screen time. Everybody can go to sleep. Yes, you need to go. And we never, oh, we did fix the sign. Oh, level three. And we got a few parts. Oh, wait. Before you go to bed, you definitely need to go use. <laughs> And then, that's not your bed. We can go to bed. Blake kind of, he probably should have used the washer before he went to bed as well. But, okay, we'll do a quick little cleanup now. April, is she completely exhausted? Okay, we'll have to send her to bed as well. But I think that is where we are going to end today's episode. You guys, I feel like we did complete a lot. I mean, Aaron even was able to go visit his father and kind of just take a tour of his home and meet a little bit more of the people that are in Don's life. So I really hope that you guys did enjoy today's episode. Make sure that you do give this video a very big thumbs up if you did and completely flood out those comments with baby name suggestions because that is gonna be coming up real soon. So thank you guys so much for watching and hopefully I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye guys.